Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse 17 down. Let me say some stuff that'll get you thinking. Here it talks about God judging the righteous and the wicked and that there's a time for both. And then he goes on to talk about the estates of the sons of men and how they are themselves beasts. It goes on to talk about these men and basically how they have the same fate of these beasts or the same thing that's going to happen to these beasts is going to happen to them. These are all going under one place. All are of the dust and all are turning of the dust again. Now pay close attention. Who knows the spirit of man that goes upward? Jesus says in John chapter 3 that a man must be born again to see the kingdom of God. In John chapter 1, it says that as many as received him, Jesus, gave power to become sons of God, those that believe on his name. And it says, born not of blood, nor of the will of man, nor of the will of the flesh, but of God. And when a person's born again, they're considered a son of God through Jesus Christ. Old things passed away, all things become new. They're considered a new creature in Christ. They're considered a new man in Christ. And what spirit do they got? The spirit of God, the Holy Spirit within them. Now back to Ecclesiastes. Who knows the spirit of the beast that goeth downward toward the earth? Where does that sound familiar? The beast. Some translations say animal here, but the King James says the beast. Now who's cast out in Revelations? Who's cut off and considered a withering branch? Now understand this, the estates of the sons of men does not have the spirit of God. They have the spirit of the world, which works in the children of disobedience. In other words, the spirit of the beast. And they do not have preeminence above a beast. So where the beast goes, they'll follow. They'll end up going as well. Jesus says a man must be born again. This is why it's appointed for a man to die once. Then the judgment. But those who are born again have already died. And they are risen in Christ. Jesus, a new man. You must be born again.